I was not for the murder one. Yeah, yeah, way back in the first season of Below Budgets, did Tommy melt a motor. I'll never forget driving that thing and just thinking, man, I must really suck at driving a stick shift. Because I've never, it just so violently shook. That was the same race that you drove straight into the wall of that one. <laughs> oh, and the red car. <laughs> and then they put the hood down and it ripped off your battery cable. <laughs> You were so looking forward to destroying that car, and the dumbest thing happened. Absolute dumbest thing happened. I thought this car just started, by the way. I was like, you fixed it. You have it. my phone. Nice. Okay, perfect. I have your, I have my phone. Well, like we s demonstrated earlier tonight, when we had a trailer race car that was down for the count, that we do these nights of destruction so often, it's not even sad anymore when we know that we have an issue. We we had like basically said, well, that car's not gonna run. Like we knew it just wasn't. And we're like, yeah, we'll see. I mean, I'd still find a way to get on the track, but sometimes you or have to something just, on the track. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just it's facing the reality of the situation. We don't have time to fix an electrical issue for that car, so we just fudge it. However, uh, thanks to Fang, the same guy that redneck I redneck motherfucking Fang, redneck who motherfucking Fang. That's how he goes. He, uh, he's the guy that I drove straight into his driver door. Remember this one? Yeah, because Shayla, Tom and I can tell you from experience what happens. It's old enough. <laughs> we did this. Uh, you folks remember season one, us doing something like... <laughs> well, that's a good sign. When I can undo it from a side that wasn't that held in very well. Yeah. So, that's good. I am losing blood though. Are you? A lot? Let me see. It's just dripping. I'm a leaker. Oh, you're dead. Well, and you drank antifreeze. That's why you wear protection! Then I'll win. I'll beat Jayla in the auto soccer. <laughs> that's fucked up. You're not supposed to beat women. <laughs> Tommy, this is the most Jerry rig. Mickey Mouse. Shayla's uncle's named Jerry. Is it? Jerry was a race car driver. <laughs> he drove for the goddamn bath. Tommy, are you, don't you want that hose to go up there? No, I got this one. Upper hose. I'm just driving. <laughs> oh. Why didn't you attach it when it was out here? I don't even know if this right hand is going to fit. Hey, look at that. It kind of fits. Why didn't you clamp it? Because I'm not Jed. <laughs> Jed Clampett, the Beverly Hillbillies. <laughs> Jed Clampett? Uh huh. Jed Clampett? Who are you, Tommy? Who is Tommy Mason tonight? Uh, Jeff Foxworthy? Only old people know that joke. Like Matt. <laughs> Panama Matt. It's entertaining for sure. <laughs> I got one guy who's a co worker at Bad Boys. He goes, <laughs> he's uh, like, uh, yeah, I need, I need this. And my co worker goes, well, I don't have that. It's not an OG part. And he's saying this to like random people. I'm like, I'm pretty sure they don't know what OG means. Again, it's going to be a lot better than what you were going to have. Yeah, well, I was going to get you a new one in the morning. A but, new um, one in the morning. But guess what? I really That's what I mean. This is a lot better. Because this is custom made. This is like a... This is with love. Made with love. It yeah. took... <laughs> this is a handmade present. This is a 10-hour mistake. Put your blood into it, I guess. <laughs> he did, didn't he? <laughs> Wet, my blood. He even tasted antifreeze for you. Yeah. Warmer? Not my fault he fucked up. <laughs> Hi. He's doing all this work and you don't even know. Trailer? <laughs> he was shitty. What do you expect out of this car? It's an auto soccer car. If it was the not the most an important car of the fleet. I'm not gonna make a dime on it, so fuck it. For what it's worth, didn't the last derby car win without a radiator? Yep. <laughs> I remember it well. I remember it playing hide and go seek with you. This is some fucked up shit. Ladies and gentlemen, at the low budgets, you never know what we're gonna fuck up next. This is a perfectly beautiful Han Toyota. Han Joda. Now it's a Han Joda. <laughs> I can tell that something's bent in that suspension for Apple Bone, but it's not as bad as I thought it was. Not as bad as my car? No, I doubt it. 
<laughs> turning left to go straight. Uh, my right. my cars my cars I think turning right to go straight. Oh, yeah. So if we drive side by side, we should go straight. Tom is showing how strong he is. I'm a pimple popper. Charlie, I hope you're getting sentimental with this car. Because I know you've always disliked it from the start. It is true, Shayla. You've had it out for this car. It's done nothing but try to be friends with you. Yeah. Someone lost the key and I put the ignition system in it. I just, I just hope that somebody sees this in a junkyard and is like, oh, perfect. The exact radiator hose I needed. <laughs> This thing has a pretty cool setup. It's got like a... He's patting himself on the back. Well, it's got no, it's flat right there. And it's flat for the radiator. So I need a cap and we're asked. Is that antifreeze? Jerry's enduro car, I don't know, it doesn't look like it. But... What do you mean it doesn't look like it? What does it look like? <laughs> I don't know, it looks like, like soup. <laughs> I was gonna say, this looks Pizza. like really old chocolate milk. I do like that this car is actually in the best shape of all three of our cars. Ow! Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, you got my elbow really good. <laughs> I'm gonna die now, just like you. Oh, where are you gonna go? Where are you gonna go? He's playing defense. He's playing defense. 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 All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, that's a wrap here on the Eve of Destruction setup for July's Night of Destruction here at Irwindale Speedway. Folks, this is gonna be the most probably jam packed. Irwindale Speedway has been in a while because they already have nearly 5,000 pre-sales as of right now. The track only holds 6,000. They're gonna jam pack them in tomorrow night. We're gonna have a huge crowd in front of us. You know, things, uh, I'd say, knock on, knock on wood. Things uh, went just about how we needed them to go tonight. Just a couple things, we're gonna put tires on uh, some trailer cars tomorrow, some fresh tires we picked up from Pick Apart, and uh, get that line fixed for my transmission. We're gonna be rerouting it, so there's a lot less line for it to get caught on. So that'll help in the future. Uh, we also have studs to put on my skip plate car, and glass to take out of these guys, and we are racing tomorrow night at seven o'clock. Baby Tom. It's showtime. It's already Saturday. We're about to go to bed. And until tomorrow, sleep tight, buckle up, and let's go for a ride. Ow. That sounded like it hurt. <laughs>